Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of SteamWorld Dig 2, where hopefully we're going to find a little bit less salt than we did on the last episode, because we are approaching the end of the game. This might actually end up being a small episode, I'm not sure how much there is left. But we got 100%, and I really wasn't actually expecting to get 100% here. Woo! That's the last one. Whoa, that was a big one. This doesn't make any sense. I thought we'd be rid of the earthquakes now. Yeah, I'm sure that was the last of these devices. I've got a bad feeling about this. There are too many unanswered questions. Doomsday cults and doc toxic jungles, and where's Rusty? Sure is fishy. Maybe it's not Rusty? Maybe Rosie's wrong? Or she's not telling us everything. We need to go back to the Oasis and have a talk with Rosie. I leveled up again. And there's still that place inside the oasis that we have yet to actually uh, open. There's a door. I wonder if she's keeping Rusty locked away. What's stopping you? Come on! That's strange. The tube back to the oasis isn't working. Fishier and fishier. Maybe the opening on that side is clogged? We'll just have to dig the last stretch to get back there. Um... Yeah, there's only one way in. Let's head back to town first, and then go there. Oh, he's got something to say. Say, the professor's getting her rocket ready for blast-off. I thought she was just a nut job, but now I'm thinking she's got the right idea, see? Space is completely unexplored and ripe with new business opportunities. I've managed to build a new life out of nothing before, kiddo. If anything, I'm more prepared now than I was when I was a youngster. Um, I don't like to bother the professor. Maybe I could ask her if I could just take a look inside the rocket now that it's done. It's really, really cool, don't you think? Not really. It's just a rocket. We've disabled all the quake generators. My seismic readings have stopped jumping around and have honed in on a single spot. That last quake came right out of Shiner Country. Uh, we really have to get back down there and talk to Rosie. Good thing my rocket is ready. Just some final preparations and I can leave if I have to. Anybody else? Guess not. Not even the mayor wants to talk to me. All right, let's go. It's going to be a short dig, but a dig nonetheless. Yeah, pretty, pretty short dig. We can kill a few things on our way. Which always makes me happy. Because we can watch them explode! Making me walk down here the old-fashioned way. How dare you. Here we... Uh, this isn't it. This is... This is a different way. Oh, jeez. Uh, ah, yeah, it's that door right there in the middle. And... Here we go. The entrance is blocked. Yeah, you think the earthquakes did this? We need to find another way in there and talk to Rosie. There are a lot of pipes around here. Maybe we can get in through the drains. I have a suspicious feeling that we'll find the other end of these pipes in the underground jungle. Well. I've already explored through there. It's just a matter of finding the right one, and I'm pretty sure that's it right there. I think I'm going to go up instead of down. Pretty sure this will be quicker. Well, how did that miss? <laughs> I 
Like, please don't follow me. Please don't follow me. And he didn't. It's amazing how little I dug before I uh, turned on explosion, explosion mode. So I guess this was a little bit of a sequence break over here, the way I uh, went through all this. Which is fine with me, it means I was able to get 100% uh, a little bit quicker. Because I shouldn't have been able to, to get through here the way I did. Well, I mean, I guess I could have. It really wasn't that difficult, it was a little tedious. But it wasn't necessary to do that kind of thing. Alright. Go for it. Well, alright. Thanks, Arachnid Armor. Appreciate you. Whoops. That's not how that works at all. Can't remember if I actually need to open this up like this or not. You know what? We'll go ahead and try this. I'm not too terribly worried about my health situation here. I heard that explode. I'm missing something here? I guess I wasn't. That was just... That was necessary to make it through this. This is where a secret was. Wait, talk to Fen? That bad feeling I got is still hanging around. Something is definitely not right. Rosie's got a lot of explaining to do once we get back to the Oasis. I should have been more suspicious from the start. Dude, look at the wires in the background. I didn't notice that last time. If you were more suspicious, then I'd probably still be alone in that temple. Now let's get out of this drain and see what's going on. More earthquakes. Where's everyone gone? Hmm, this is creeping me out. We have to find Rosie and see what she's been up to. Well, this is finally open. And this looks like a, a shrine of some sort. This thing is looking really ominous when it's open. Are you sure we want, need to go in there? I think we have to, Fen. Okay, let's just see what the shiners, big shiners got cooking in here. The reactor. Just got one of those machines in here. It's a boss arena! Rusty? Dot? You really shouldn't have come back here. What are you doing? Let him go, Rosie! Do you know how many shiners were hurt capturing him? He's a monster! Now he's just a battery in my mech suit, and I'm finally strong enough to keep your kind out. You lied to me. I used you. You're a tool. And I needed someone to disable those pesky devices. He built them to draw all the power from my fusion distillery, but no more. This reactor gave me what I need to control my kin. An endless supply of moon juice. They will have no reason to wander off. They will stay safe and show me the respect I deserve! Ah, so this is what you meant when you said the Shiners were deranged and dangerous. The earthquakes. The reactor's unstable. Uh, the reactor is unstable, Vectron Tech. No! You're unstable! I'm finally in control! You're insane! Enough of this! All right, what is... Oh, I see what, you, I see what you, you want from me. Oh. Are you flying now? 
Oh god. Oh god. Ooh. Ooh, bullets. I didn't need to do that. Dude, there's a shiner in the background. Do I have a goal here? Yeah. Shouldn't have touched that. Do I have a goal here? Ow. Eh. I thought maybe that was it. Ah. Uh, you should know better than to do that. Now what? Oh, bricks. Bricks and birds may break my turds, but names will ne- what? Brah? Yeah, okay, you got bouncy balls going everywhere. What is this? This ain't so bad. I mean, the trials were harder than this. I learned. I learned from the trials. Ouch. Ah! Where'd the bird... The, why'd the bird die? That was weird. Oh, this place is filled with acid now. That's, that's fantastic. This is breakout. This is straight up breakout right now. Oh god. All right, now what do you got for me? Is it some? Ah! That'd be funny if that hurt her. All right, now you're punching. Oh, and bullets. Okay. You're doing a lot of damage now. Bound to shoot a missile any moment now. Yeah, here we go. Acid is rising higher. I'm pretty sure it's moon juice, not acid, but whatevs. Thank you, Arachnid Armor. Alright, she's punching now. But she does two moves, and then I'm safe. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Ah. I probably shouldn't have done that. Oh, they came back. Oh, oh, oh! I missed! That's not good. There, there we go. Bada bing, bada yo, screwed, lady! Rusty! The reactor, it's gonna blow! The quakes will destroy everything! You must get out of here! Scrap that! We'll make it out together! Hey, this thing is going haywire! Let's get out of here now! Professor Sherman's rocket! We need to get back up to town now! I can't, I can't do my teleporty thing. He 
can't be that heavy, can he? Well, that's convenient. And we're gonna use this somehow, aren't we? Come on, Finn! We have to hurry! There's no way we'll make it back to the city like this. But I can get to the two of you out of time. No way, I'm not leaving you down here. You can't go through this thing with us. There's no time to argue. There's no other way. You two get in here. Now! God, I can't get that voice right now. That Fen voice. Fen, I'll come back for you. I know you will. Now go! See you around, Dot. It's the three brothers. They all made it back. Gah! Get out of the way! Mayors and child bots first! I'm sorry, I'm, I'm going as fast as I can. Calm down, folks, one at a time! Form an orderly line now, you hear? Hey, we ain't got time for lines. Just get a, just get on the rocket before this whole place collapses on us. Boat your jaw, son. We just got bots down in the darn mine. We can't just leave folk behind. Mr. Heisenberg is ready to ignite the rocket, but I can hold to, hold the launch for a minute or two. But then we have to blast off. We blood arm. He's not a robot. He's a freaking. Yeah, you said it, Mr. Barnacle. <laughs> what? I ain't said nothing. What in tarnation? Oh, there you are, dearie. Thank goodness you're safe. Good show. I was... Oh, wait. Good show. I was worried you got yourself lost. There's so many voices. I see you found the red scarfed miner. But where's that glowing little friend of yours? It's a long story. I have to... Well, I am happy to see you safe and sound, but I must stress that we really are out of time. Everyone aboard the rocket. Time for some Steambot space adventures. Yeehaw! What about the three brothers? Are they just going to be left behind? Wait a minute. Is there a better ending than this? There's got to be a better ending than this. I mean, the cultists are cheering. Dorothy looks sad. And Barnacle Jones looks confused and scared. Look at how sad she looks. The planet exploded? Is there a true ending? Uh, do they... They're all floating? Rebuild civilization and find Finn. Huh. I'm not seeing anything about a, uh, like a, a good ending. I mean, the whole planet was destroyed. This can't be a good ending. Unless this is to set the stage for SteamWorld Dig 3 and some weird floating island weirdness or something. I don't know. That'd be kind of interesting, I guess. Huh. The ending is so, um... I don't know what to say about it. It's wrong, man. The planet exploded. The planet just can't explode. 
Uh, well, all right. So, mm, yeah, I'm not. I'm not finding anything. So, yeah, that's it. This is the credits. Hope you enjoyed the playthrough. I enjoyed the playthrough. The uh, Cave of Trials was a little bit garbage. Just a couple parts of it, not all of it. Some of it was really fun. Um, but there were a few parts of it that just made me... Mmm, salty. Ugh. Music by El Huervo. They are copyright claiming a lot of my videos, but it looks like I'm able to get those back. I've been disputing them. Uh, we'll see, though. It's not a big loss. This channel's not big enough for me to see any real money off of anyway, so it's... whatever. Language consultants. Not a lot of testers. See that? They got people to test the game instead of doing early access. A lot of people named Johansson, though. That's interesting. Johansson. So that was a that was a good time. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it too. I'm hoping we see a third SteamWorld dig with this crazy weird floating world. Or maybe this floating world is uh something that No, apparently SteamWorld heist. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, maybe maybe the floating islands are what SteamWorld heist has. I don't know. I don't know. This game was a lot of fun, though. Uh, especially once I started able, being able to dig, like, really quickly through everything, and I started being able to kill flies with hook shots and then make them explode because of the extra upgrades that I put on. That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Oh, wow, my ranking is bronze. My wealth is gold, my secrets are gold, and my deaths is silver. Gee, thanks. This was a good time. Nice, uh... Nice seamless transition, actually. But yeah, hope you enjoyed it. This series is over, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye!